I'm going to demonstrate you a test which is called a pivot shift test. This is a test which is done for an incompetent ACL. If this test is positive, then it shows ACL is functionally incompetent. This test is usually done under anesthesia. However, if your technique is good and if you have learned the art, you will be able to do this test in awake patients as well. So when you do a pivot shift test, you uh, do this test, with, you start the test with leg in extension and then you put internal rotation of the leg and then you need to give a valgus force. And in this position, the tibia is subluxed and as you flex the knee, the ITB or iliotibial band acts as a hip flexor and then it reduces it. So this is the biomechanics and I will show you how I do it. What I do is, I grab the leg and I put it in my axilla and with my, I will put my hand across the proximal part of the tibia and I will use this hand and axilla to do this internal movement and with this hand I am going to give a valgus stress as well. It's a good idea to talk to the patient and try to distract them and make sure these hamstrings are relaxed. The key is you need to take the patient in confidence. Once the patient is in confidence and then if you do this and the patient has what faith that you are not going to do any uh, harm or give them any pain then you have a chance that you will be able to elicit this test. And so what I do is just, so if you do this, you can see this, if Varun can show it from the other side. All I am doing is internal rotation and valgus with this hand and you can see it's pivoting. So it's starting with, in this position it is sublux and as I flex the knee it goes past 30 degree it reduces. So this is a typically positive pivot shift test. So same thing I am just going it to show it from a medial side so that you can appreciate how does it pivot. So same thing just relax the patient and then you can see this pivoting here. So viewers this was a demonstration of a pivot shift test. It's a test but it's an art. If you learn this art you will be able to do this test even in a weak patient taking patient in confidence. I hope you like this video. Do subscribe to our channel and do share this video. Thank you.